Kreuzer Pub to the Big in Japan PSN sale. This is a huge sale, perfect for anime fans. And there's great news, I found over £560 worth of deals for you. So I hope you're ready to save a lot of money and find some cool games to play. Don't forget to subscribe if you don't want to miss the next sale and save you for more money and find some more cool games. Okay, this sale ends on the 9th of March, so I'll be your last day to pick up these deals. Let's look at the games. First up is Aegis of Earth Protonovus Assault. It was released in 2016, so it's 6 years old, and it's at a 75% discount for the low price of £3.19, which is the cheapest I've ever seen it and a really great deal. This is a tower defence game where you defend the last bastion of humanity against an unending onslaught of monster attacks by collecting resources to research and build new units and upgrade your city. It features unlockable commanders with unique abilities to help you and your city survive. I'm a pretty big tower defence fan and I've never seen a game like this before. It's very unique with the gameplay, how you build items in your city and then you can rotate parts of the city to point your weapons in different directions. It may not be the most demanding or graphically intense game you've ever seen, but if you love tower defense, then you want to look at this game because it's very unique and different. And if you've never played the tower defense before, then you might want to look elsewhere as this is a pretty different one. We have an action RPG next, A Keeper's Trip Undead and Undressed. It was released in 2015, so it's 7 years old, and it's on an 80% discount for the price of £5.99, which is the cheapest I've ever seen it and a great deal. This PS4 edition also includes a toy box mode and a visual editor as well. In this action RPG, which is set in the Akihabara district of Tokyo, you must hunt and murder vampires, known as synthesters, by stripping their clothes off, exposing them to their sunlight doom, in the hope to save Japan from being overrun by vampires. This game may sound a bit weird, but hey, welcome to the world of anime games, and anime in general. In any case, if you're a fan of action RPGs, and you like anime-style games, you might want to check this out. It's very popular, and it's at a good price. And hey, if you've never played a game like this before, then I would recommend it if you're a fan of anime, and if you're not, probably not. But hey, if you've never delved into the world of anime either, then you might want to try it, because it's definitely going to be different. Why not take a look? And on a side note, A Keeper's Beat is also on sale for 80% £3.19 price, which is the cheapest I've ever seen it, so if you want that one as well, or instead, Take a look at that as well. Next up is Aster Breed. It was released in 2015, so it's 7 years old, and it's on an 80% discount for the price of £2.31, which is really cheap. In this 3D arcade shooter, where mankind is at the edge of eradication, only Aster Breed can fight back against the swarming enemies that will end humanity. It features mech piloting, with weapons including long-range lasers, homing missiles and blade attacks as well. This seems like a pretty straightforward arcade shooter, but hey, they're really popular, and if you like them, you'll probably enjoy this one, and it's at a really good price. So if you're a fan of these, take a look at it. And if you've never played one before, then at this price, why not check it out? You might really enjoy it, and find a new genre that you like. Our next game is Kreuzler Sigma. It was released in 2016, so it's 6 years old, and it's on an 80% discount for the low price of £2.29, which is really good. In this hack and slash action game, you get to play as 4 girls, wielding magic blades, the fight wave after wave of monsters in this simple but fun game. It features various weapon combinations, cosmetics, full voice acting, a score attack mode, challenge mode, and dungeon modes as well. So if you're a fan of hack and slash games, at this price you should definitely check this out. You might really enjoy it. And if you've never played a hack and slash game before, then again it's really cheap and you might really enjoy it. Definitely worth checking out if anyone's at all interested. We have a dungeon crawler next, Demon Gaze 2. It was released in 2017 so it's 5 years old and is on at least a 75% discount for the price of £11.24 or £6.74 with PS Plus. Which is a really great deal for PS Plus members. In this dungeon crawler, Magnastar has spellbound the people of Asteria into obeying him, but you are the demon gazer, able to wield the power of demons to start a revolution to liberate the people of Asteria. So it looks like a pretty standard anime storyline, but it's a very old school dungeon crawler, the type that hasn't been around for decades, where it's first person, you pick the direction you go and you see what's there. If you were around in those days and you loved those games, then you'll probably really enjoy this, but if you've never heard of them and you don't know what I'm talking about, 
this is very unlikely to be a game you'll enjoy. But hey, if you like trying something different and you want to take a chance, you might just want to take a look at it. But there are other options that do get cheaper than this, so if you're not sure, you might want to check out another sale instead. Up next is Devil May Cry 4 Special Edition. It was released in 2015, so it's 7 years old, but it's a much older game than that really, and it's on a 70% discount for the price of £5.99, which is pretty good. This special edition is remastered in full HD, 60 frames per second, with new playable characters, a legendary Dark Knight mode, and more. So you're getting a lot extra for your money as well, which is cool. In this third person action game, Dante has assassinated the leader of the Order of the Sword, so now it's up to the demonic powered teenager Nero to find and stop him. You get to play as both Dante and Nero throughout this game as they fight demonic enemies in an intertwining storyline. This game's from a legendary series of third person action games, so if you're a fan of that genre and you never played this one, then you should check it out. But if you haven't played the previous ones, they do go on sale as a bundle, so you might want to pick them up first if you haven't played any of them. They're all great, and you'll really enjoy them if you like this genre. And if you've never played a third person action game like this, then I wouldn't recommend it. You're better off buying the bundle of the earlier games, or trying a different game in the genre instead. So take a look around. Up next is my star by Digimon World Next Order. It was released in 2017, so it's 5 years old, and it's on at least an 84% discount for a price of £6.39 or £2.39 with PS Plus, which is the cheapest I've ever seen it and a really great deal for this series. In this RPG, you get to recruit faithful Digimon and raise two at a time, fusing them together to create more powerful monsters to use in real-time battles that favour Digimon cooperation and tactics. I was definitely more of a Pokemon guy than a Digimon guy, but hey, this is a really popular series, this looks like an awesome game, it's really well reviewed, and it's at a dirt cheap price. There's a reason it's my star buy. If you love Digimon and you haven't played this, definitely take a look at it. And if you've never played a game like this before and you're not a fan of Digimon, then why not take a look at it anyway? It's really cheap and it's a good game. If you're interested, you can't go far wrong. You might even find your new favourite genre. It's my star buy. Well worth taking a look at. We have a beat em up next Dusk Diver. It was released in 2019, so it's 3 years old, and it's on at least a 65% discount for the price of £10.49 or £7.49 with PS Plus, which is pretty good. In this game, when an unstable dimensional rift unleashes gods and phantoms on the human world, a high school girl called Yang Yumo must fight alongside the Guardians to defeat them. It features a vivid depiction of the streets of Xingmen Ding and a full voiceover as well. You don't see many beat em ups these days, and this looks like a pretty decent one. And it's modern too, with 3D graphics making it even rarer for a beat em up genre game. So if you're a fan of beat em up games, you should definitely take a look at it, you'll probably be really interested. And if you've never played a beat em up before, then I wouldn't recommend this one. You can get other ones for much cheaper than this, so you're better off starting there instead. We have a wrestling game next Fire Pro Wrestling World Deluxe Edition. It was released in 2018, so it's 4 years old, and it's on an 80% discount for the price of £14.99, which isn't bad, as this edition includes 3 DLC, the Fire Promoter, Fighter Road 2017 NJPW Junior Heavyweight Championship, and an additional scenario DLC as well, so you do get a lot of extra content included with this edition. This game is based on the old school classic, and features ultimate customization, where even the ring can be customised. And you can also download and share your own wrestlers online, and it includes 4 player online multiplayer as well. So there's a lot of fun to be had downloading wrestlers from online and also making your own and putting them up for other people to play with. So if you're a fan of old school wrestling games that are 2D and not 3D, this is the ultimate game for you. And if you're a fan of wrestling and you're willing to overlook the 2D graphics, then there's a lot of good fun to be had in this series. You might just want to take a look around. Giga Rekka Alt is our next game. It was released in 2019, so it was 3 years old, and it's on at least a 65% discount for the price of £6.99 or £4.99 with PS Plus, which is a pretty good deal. In this action platformer, set in the near future on an Earth ravaged by an alien invasion, the hope of humanity rests in a girl saved from death and cursed with cybernetic powers beyond comprehension. It features frantic platforming, physics puzzles and intense combat. This looks like a really cool action platformer, 
with some pretty cool physics-based mechanics as well. If you're a fan of the genre, you should take a look at it because it looks really good. Especially because it's made by Game Freak. Yep, that's right, the makers of Pokemon. So hey, it's got heritage as well. And if you've never played an action platformer before, then I wouldn't recommend this one. You can get other ones much cheaper than this, so you're better off looking elsewhere. Our next game is God Eater 3. It was released in 2019, so it's 3 years old, and it's on an 86% discount for the price of £6.99, which is really good. This action RPG is set in a post-apocalyptic world, filled with massive monsters known as Aragami. You must wield God Arc weapons and burst attacks to defeat them, and fight for the survival of mankind. It features 8-player online multiplayer as well, although again with these sorts of niche games, no guarantee how active that is these days. But hey, if you're a fan of the anime, or you like anime-inspired games, then you'll probably enjoy this game anyway, so why not take a look? Next up is Jojo's Bizarre Adventure Eyes of Heaven. It was released in 2016, so it's 6 years old, and is on an 86% discount for the price of £6.71, which is really great. As this version even includes a lot of DLC that wasn't free in the Japan release, so you do get a bit extra for your money, which is really cool. This game is a third person action brawler with 2v2 fights, with team attacks in big open arenas filled with tons of interactions. It also features an exclusive original story and more than 50 characters from the first 8 chapters of the manga. So if you're a Jojo fan, you'll absolutely love this game. And if you're not a Jojo fan, then at this price you might want to pick it up as a brawler game, but make that decision yourself because it'll depend how much you'll get out of this game without liking Jojo. We have a visual novel next, Kotodama The Seven Mysteries of Fujisawa. It was released in 2019, so it's three years old, and is on an 80% discount for the low price of £2.99, which is the cheapest I've ever seen it, and a great deal. In this game you get to investigate seven mysteries, solving the puzzle phase to strip your target naked and expose their lies to solve the mystery. With repeat playthroughs you get to uncover more facts, finding them all uncovers the true ending, and the full art gallery for the game as well. So there's a lot of content and it encourages more than one playthrough. So if you're a fan of visual novels and match three puzzles, you'll really enjoy this game. And it's really cheap as well, so you should definitely take a look at it if that's the case. And hey, if you've never played a visual novel before, then you might want to play this one. It's really cheap and it's got some cool puzzle gameplay as well. So why not take a look if you like the sound of that? We have a cool fighter next. Nitro Plus Blasters Heroines Infinite Duel. It was released in 2016, so it's 6 years old, and it's on a 75% discount for the price of £3.99, which is really great. This fighter features characters from the Nitro Plus visual novels, and it includes a story mode, 25 campaigns, a partner blitz mode with 20 partners to choose from, Lethal Blaze anime cutscene attacks, local multiplayer, and 2v2 online multiplayer as well. Although I don't know how active that is anymore. This looks like a really cool 2D fighter. It may not be one of the big AAA franchises, but it's got a great reputation, and people really like it. So if you're looking for a different fighter, definitely check this one out. And if you've never played a 2D fighter before, then this one's a pretty decent one. So if you're a fan of anime, definitely take a look at it. It's at a decent price, and it's a great game. Next up is a blast from the past, Onimusha Warlords. It was released in 2019, so it was 3 years old, but it's a remaster of a much older game, and it's on a 60% discount for the price of £6.39, which is really good, as this version is remastered with a widescreen aspect ratio, high resolution graphics and modernised controls as well. In this action horror, you play as the samurai Samusuka Akechi and his partner Keidi, who after defeating evil Nobunaga Oda, must rescue Princess Yuki from his demons. It features multiple upgradable weapons and some cool spells as well. This was a legendary series back in the day, and what it basically is, is Resident Evil, but samurai themed, with melee weapons and demons. I mean, can you ask for anything better? If you're a fan of the Resident Evil series, especially the originals, or the recent remake, then you should 100% check this out, especially if you've never heard of it. I promise you, you'll absolutely love it if you're a fan of those games. You're welcome. And hey, if you've never played an action horror game like this before, then I would recommend it. It's a really great game from a really great game series, and I really hope they remaster the sequels as well, and even make a new one, why not? It deserves it, because the game's that great. It's well worth taking a look at. 
more visual novel next, Punchline. It was released in 2018, so it's four years old, and it's on a 75% discount for the price of £8.74, which is pretty good. This is a visual novel where you play as a friendly ghost haunting a house full of girls, solving puzzles, playing tricks, and causing trouble. Can you solve the mystery to regain your body? Who knows, but it features time travel, elaborate pranks, and a different ending to the anime. So if you're a fan of the anime, you don't have to worry about already knowing the whole story, because this is different. This is definitely a weird one, and if you're not an anime fan or a fan of the series, I wouldn't recommend it, because it is very different. And unless you're familiar with the sorts of games you get from anime, you want to stay clear. But if it sounds good to you, you'll really enjoy this, so take a look at it. We have a beat em up next, Senran Kagura Burst Renewal Shinobi Rivals Edition. It was released in 2019, so it's 3 years old, and it's on a 70% discount for the price of £13.49, which is a bit high compared to the normal prices I pick, but hey, it's worth it, as this edition includes the OST, Yumi character, an additional story mission, two outfits, and a diorama set as well. So it's got quite a bit of extra content, and it's a really good price for this game series. This game is built on the Estival vs engine, with enhanced visuals and new full 3D levels and combat, where you get to control over 20 playable characters in shinobi based combat, and it features a story playable from two perspectives, with over 150 cosmetics and a diorama mode as well. So there's a lot of stuff to collect, and you can even create a diorama to enjoy all the stuff you've collected as well, which is different and pretty unique. This game series is probably more famous for its characters assets than the gameplay, but they're actually really great games. And hey, this is an anime game. If you don't like fan service, why are you looking at anime games? In any case, if you like beat em ups and anime, then you should definitely take a look at this, especially if you played the first game and you enjoyed it. There's a lot of fun to be had with this game. And hey, if you've never played a beat em up before, then I wouldn't say to start here, because you can get much cheaper games from other series. So subscribe and you won't miss them when they come on sale. We have a side-scrolling shooter next, Sign Mora EX. It was released in 2017, so it's 5 years old, and it's on at least a 70% discount for the price of £4.79, or £3.19 with PS Plus, which isn't too bad. This is a great modern side-scrolling shooter, with huge boss battles, great 3D visuals and varied gameplay. It features 3 versus modes, new challenge levels, local 2-player co-op, added English voiceovers, and optional new 16x9 aspect ratio. These days they don't make that many side-scrolling shooters, so if you've been looking for a modern one, this is a really good one, and you'll probably really enjoy it, so why not take a look at it? Our next game is Song of Memories. It was released in 2019, so it's 3 years old, and it's on a 75% discount for the price of £7.49, which isn't bad. This is a romantic story with dark undertones. This musical-themed love story takes a dark turn as an apocalyptic virus begins sweeping across the world and threatens to infect those closest to you. So it seems like a pretty unusual story for a visual novel. But hey, if you're a fan of visual novels, that'll be great for you because it's different. But again, if you're not a fan of visual novels, there's a few that are on sale that you might be tempted to pick up. But if you're not interested at all, there's plenty more games for you to check out. Our next game is pretty unique. Tokyo Twilight Ghost Hunters Daybreak Special Gigs. It was released in 2016, so it's 6 years old, and it's on a 70% discount for the price of £4.79, which is pretty good. This is an RTS crossed with a visual novel, where you play as the gatekeepers, who gather an array of talented individuals who have the ability to see ghosts, and now must battle against the evil spirits lurking within the shadows of Tokyo. This is an extremely unique game, I don't think I've ever seen a visual novel with turn-based tactical gameplay in it before, which is very odd, and it would probably appeal to a lot of people. It'll be a niche market, but they'll love it. So if you're a fan of tactical RPG, specifically turn-based, and if you're a fan of visual novels, then you might want to try this game because it combines the two and I doubt you've ever seen anything like it before. And if this all sounds weird, then stay clear, it's probably a bit too unusual for you. Tokyo Xanadu EX Plus is our next game. It was released in 2017, so it's 5 years old, and it's on an 80% discount for the price of £9.99, which isn't bad, as this edition is remastered with 60fps and includes new scenarios, new playable characters, new modes, and more as well. So they've really added a lot extra to this version of the game, which is great. In this game you play a high school student, Ko, 
who follows his friends into an alley where they are drawn into the nightmare realm known as Eclipse, where they now work with the Nemesis group to try and close the interdimensional vortexes for good. This looks like a pretty decent RPG, but it doesn't have a big blockbuster name attached to it, so if you're a fan of a particular series, you're bound to like one of the other games in this sale, but if you're not, this is definitely worth considering. Our next game is Travis Strikes Again, No More Heroes Complete Edition. It was released in 2019, so it's 3 years old, and it's on a 75% discount for the price of £8.24, which is pretty good, as this edition includes both DLC expansions, the Black Dandelion and Bubblegum Fatale. In this top-down hack-and-slash game, after Batman comes knocking to avenge his daughter, him and Travis get sucked into a games console, and now must work together to fight their way through a load of games, to escape back to the real world. This is a pretty old school top down hack and slash game that's very arcadey, so if you're a fan of the No More Heroes series and you're looking for more of that, this is not here. If you're a fan of old school arcade games though and you like hack and slash ones, this is definitely something you'll enjoy. So it's a bit niche, but if you like the sound of it, you'll probably really enjoy it, especially if you're a fan of the No More Heroes franchise. But if you're not, then I'm not sure you'll enjoy this game. You might want to take a look at it but it's very niche, so make sure you give it a good looking over before you buy it. But hey, you might love it, who knows? Up next is another fighter, Under Night in Birth EX Late ST. It was released in 2018, so it's 4 years old, and it's on a 74% discount for the price of £5.19, which isn't bad. From the makers of the cult classic Melty Blood comes this 2D fighter, promising to be easy to pick up and full of tactical depth. It features 20 characters, multiple modes, tutorials, 2 player local and 8 player online multiplayer. So you do get quite a lot of features for your money and it's from a company that's got a good history. So if you're a fan of 2D fighters then you should probably take a look at this game because it looks really good. And hey if you've never played a 2D fighter before then I'm not sure if I'd recommend this one. You can get other cheaper ones so you might want to start there instead. Subscribe and you won't miss them when they come on sale. And the final game I have for you is Zone of the Enders Second Runner Mars. It was released in 2018, so it's 3 years old, and it's on a 75% discount for the price of £6.24, which is really good. And this version is enhanced in 4K, with full VR support as well, which is unbelievably awesome. So you can pilot mechs like you've always dreamed of, from the pilot seat in full virtual reality. This is a AAA game from back in the day, I love this series, and the chance to play in VR just makes my heart sing. If you like Mac games or anime, take a look at this, especially if you've got a VR headset, it'll make you cream your pants, it's that good. And that's all the games I have for you for the Big in Japan PSN sale. Hey, out of curiosity, this channel's not monetized, obviously because I have very little subscribers and very little views, but I'm interested to see if they run ads anyway. So if you see adverts on these videos I put out, just let me know in the comments. I'd be interested to know if they run them and what country you're from. Anyway, what did you think of the games I picked? Did you like them? Did you hate them? And what about the star buy? Did it deserve it? Or was something else a better choice? Let me know in the comments and we can argue about it later. Anyway, I hope you guys found some games you're interested in. But more importantly, I hope you guys saved a lot of money. I'll see you guys in the next sale. Hoyle Vaur.